after the break, I received a gift. Ed Brindley is the creator of the AY sound cards for RC2014. That's an 8-bit sound chip and a pretty standard sound module for the RC2014. Ed has been talking about creating an FM sound card for some years now, and here it is. The card just contains the Yamaha chip, the DAC that goes with it, and a dressing logic. I'm really glad that Ed's done this work and I'm very grateful for this. I think it looks the part and it certainly sounds great. You're hearing one of the example tracks in the background. Although I don't have personal experience or nostalgia for this type of sound card, we're talking early PC sound cards like Adlib and Sound Blaster, and synthesizers like the DX1000. I'm keen to learn more about FM synthesis and excited by the possibilities. We spent some time listening to some of the examples and I started to learn how to use a tracker that can export files that will play on this card. What I'm going to play you shortly is my first attempt. The tracker is very similar to others that I've used and I've entirely used existing sound patches. I haven't ventured into creating FM sounds yet. So thank you to Magmania for making his instrument collection available. Most of this is typed into the tracker, but I improvised the solo line on a MIDI keyboard into Logic Pro and then transcribed that manually into the tracker. The music player software that Ed has provided handles VGM files, which is a common format for ripped video game music and music that's written for this type of sound card. The audio is captured directly from Ed's sound card in my CPM RC2014, driven by the Z80 processor in here. My working title was First Try, which became Firsty. This is it. Thank you. 